I'm back doing one of my favourite things to do. Oh, you bugger. Oh, got me out of the rocks. So today I'm doing one of my favourite things to do. And I did a video on it a few weeks ago and it was about throwing hard body lures especially for finger mark around the rock bars. Rock bars everywhere over Cape York and I can't say one's any better than the other one. So find a nice rock bar and you can do this sort of thing but I'm fishing with soft plastics today instead of hard bodies just to to do something a little bit different. I'm still chasing finger mark but I'll probably get a heap of different things over these rocks so let's get after them. going on around the place at the moment so that's a good sign I've I'm fishing with no electric motor at the moment and that's that's a good thing when I'm doing videos because not everyone's got electric motor so you don't really need it, it does help and I've had to order a new one because I've worn my old one out and I'm just waiting on it to arrive it's the wet season so everything gets a little bit pretty slow but um, I've anchored on the sand just before this rock bar and I'll show you the anchor rope here. I've let a heap of anchor rope out so I can pull myself over the top of this rock bar. I'll let the current pull me over the top of this rock bar and start fishing it. You don't want to throw your anchor over the top of rocks unless you've got a reef anchor. That is a rock. It's one of those fish that don't pull back. Yeah, anchor yourself up and let your boat drift over the top of the rocks. And you can work an area really thoroughly before you move on. And I might spend half an hour or so here because there's so many fish in these rocks. And enticing them out one at a time and heaps of fun. So I moved to a new spot. The last spot was really shallow. It was only about a metre and a half deep on average with, with rocks just half a metre under the surface. So it was really shallow. Oh, that's a good hit. That's a good sign already. Just got here. <laughs> and um, so now I'm fishing in three metres of water. Oh, two bites. I don't think it was a finger mark though. Sorry, I'm distracted. Three metres of water. So I've changed to a curly tail soft plastic, a Berkeley Gulp. I was using Z-Mans before, but they're just too buoyant. Because I want to get down a little bit deeper, uh, this little curly tail will be perfect.
in a lot of trouble here. This is a big fish. That's a messy queen. Friends is a queenfish. Oh, look at that! Mate, I'm gonna let you go. What a crazy fish. There you go, mate. There you go, mate. Wow. So oh, I came out here chasing finger mark. Didn't get many finger mark, but had a good day.